Uh, here's a look right now at what we're dealing with. Obviously, no water coming from the sky. We're not going to see that for quite some time. I don't see any storms near our uh, horizon at all uh, to talk about even our next rain chance. But for now, what we're watching for is our next cooling chance. And it does look like the middle of next week. That's when we'll get it. So this holiday weekend, we've warned you uh, time and time again that it's going to be a very hot one. And now the timing of the excessive heat of the hottest days, it's shifting a little. Right now, 73, you're waking up to that here. Downtown San Diego, 74 in El Cajon, 78 in Alpine. And then our winds, look at this, about 10 miles per hour in Campo, 11 in Escondido. So we're getting a bit of an offshore wind that's coming through the mountains and down into the foothills. That dries the air, so that, of course, is an issue. By 1 o'clock, 2 o'clock this afternoon, look kind of the swirl that happens here. So we're going to get an easterly and southerly component of the wind right through that border 32 fire. So that's that's unfortunately when some fire activity might pick up. It's also when the smoke might become a little more widespread. So that's what you'll likely see after your lunch break today. If you're uh, headed out maybe early because of course it's a holiday weekend, uh, you know, just know that it might look hazy. Some areas across our county were in that yellow range when it comes to air quality. So if you're unhealthy, uh, excuse me, sensitive, it's unhealthy for you. Uh, also that includes of course where the fire is just west of Campo. 97 today in El Cajon. 100 in Campo, 97 in Escondido, 96 in Poway. El Cajon got up to 98 yesterday, so you're pretty close to that again. Uh, places like Rancho Bernardo got up to 100 degrees. Escondido hit 104, so it does look like you're a little bit cooler today by a few degrees. I do want to show you the next three days so you can plan your weekend. Look how much hotter it will get tomorrow. So today's the day we drop a tiny bit, and then tomorrow we go right back up by 4 to 5 degrees. So you see that there, especially in in El Cajon, Santee, Ramona. That's where things are going to be again in the triple digits and you'll notice that through Sunday. So Labor Day Monday was going to be the hottest day. It looks like things taper down a little bit, just a couple of degrees on Monday and Tuesday. And then we're not out of the triples until Wednesday, then Thursday, Friday, clouds, cooler air. That's all expected to return. So those are the days we can look forward to. Until then, uh, we coming up, we do have some tips on what you can do other than going to the beach that will help cool you down. Eric.